Simpson said that Finn upstaged him, which Don't, just goes to show you how delusional Elias truly is. No attack tonight, guys. This is one-on-one -on -one action, and I think it's going to be a, 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 a great test for both of these young men. Of Elias Sampson. Done a lot of research, spent some time with Elias over the past couple of weeks, and... Have you showered recently? Uh, he's been filling me in on the legend of Elias, so to speak, as Finn catches him with a shot to the kidney. Now a side headlock on Sampson. Fowler's looking to disprove any legend of Sampson. Like I said, I like the contest. You know, you got to know how good you are. And for both of these young men at this stage of their careers, you know, it's, there's a learning experience. Caught him with an elbow to the face. Elias Sampson with a scar on the right elbow. Told me the story of how he got it. As Finn oh. Balor delivers a drop kick to the face of Sampson. Said he was hitchhiking from Vegas to Omaha to see an Eric Clapton concert. Stopped in a bar along the way. Got in a fight when somebody tried to call him out. And guy uh, caused a big wound to his elbow. And then he beat the guy up and did a, a Clapton tune at the bar with his guitar. Oh! Balor with a kick right to the ear. I'm still trying to digest all that nonsense you just spewed, Cole. Balor looking to... Make a cover tune here tonight. Let's call it. Sampson rough and rugged as they come. Nice suplex. Here's the cover on Balor and a kick out. And Corey, this is how Sampson really turned it on during the commercial break. My distaste for his musical ability aside, Sampson can get it done and handle his business in the ring. Look at the height on his knee right across the back of Finn's neck. You know, you know what? I think Corey just became a belief. Yeah, Booker, you've been uh, believing in Elias Sampson since his first debut here on Monday Night Raw. Uh, I like the kid. I like his style. And right now, he, he's this is a, Booker, this is a smart strategy right here. Samson going right to the full Nelson, focusing on the neck of Finn Balor. If Samson wants to take it to the next level, this is the kind of strategy he needs. Corey, let me tell you, let me say what you just said. Right now, oh, look at this. Shoulders Samson. down now. Balor trying to steal one. Elias Samson is playing a tune on Finn Balor. I like the way I said it better. Look at the elbow now. Balor looking to escape the clutches of the more powerful Samson. <clears throat> Samson delivering a knee right to the gut of Balor and really manhandling Finn here and the early going part of this matchup. You know what I liked about this matchup is oh. I knew it was some one point in time one of these men were gonna have to test themselves and take it to another level and this might be it right here. Yeah, Finn Balor looking to do just that, building some momentum, just glancing blow uh, off that drop kick by Finn to Sampson and Sampson's lucky Finn didn't get all of that. And now Balor with a chop. Into the corner, another chop by Finn Balor. Thunderous knife edge chops on repeat. And Sampson caught him with a boot to the face. Yep. Oh! Knocking Sampson off the top rope. Ballard could be thinking about taking to the air. And down goes Sampson. Well, you wouldn't make Finn Balor so dangerous, guys, is he generates a lot of speed in a short amount of distance. Ballard definitely explosive. Oh, oh and he caught oh. him. Wow. Finn went for the kick, and then he landed hard on his shoulder. Remember, Finn Balor missed a significant part of late 2016 and the early part of this year with a shoulder injury. Suffered at SummerSlam last year, and Samson taking advantage. Watch this. This was incredibly well scouted by Samson. Catching the kick, planting Balor face first on the apron. And Samson, once again, this is a smart strategy. I'll give credit where it's due. Look at the Fujiwara armbar. Take another look here. Finn Balor going for that patented running punt. And it was Samson who turned the tables. And now to your point, Corey, great strategy by Samson here. You have to be impressed with Elias Samson, the early part of his career. As Balor makes it to the bottom rope, it's going to force a break at five. Tell the story right there, guys. Finn Balor just went to the bottom rope just to relieve the pressure. I mean, that could have been a tap out that easily. Well, you're not going to get too many opportunities in a match against a competitor that's as world class as Finn Balor. Samson is making the most whoa, of his whoa, opportunities. Whoa. And that buys Finn valuable time. Illustrates my point. All Finn needs is a heartbeat to change the pace of a match. Finn, the thing is, like I say, guys, that he, he relies on his quickness, he relies on his speed. That you don't want from this young man, Finn Balor. Let's take another look at this. Look at the height, the vertical leap of Ballard, but most importantly, two feet right in the sternum of Samson. Samson again sidestepping Ballard, just almost a step ahead of the game all night here. You know what this is, man. I, mean, I can tell you what this is. This is Samson looking to put himself in contentionship. I That's mean, not a word, Booker. 
what, what, what word did you want to use? Contention ship? Yeah. That's not a word, but I understand your point. You're right. Look at this. Smart move by Samson Samson right back to the arm. Shoulders down. May have him here. And a kick out of two just barely for Balor. I, I, it pains me to say, but you got to give credit to Samson. Cover again by Samson. Hooks the inside leg. Shoulders down. Whoa. Great position by the official and a kick out of two. Samson like a shark that smells blood in the water. And again, Samson continues to work on the injured shoulder of Finn Balor. Samson's proven he's a player, guys. Oh. He's not here. To oh. oh, man. Caught him with that overhead kick right on the, the jaw. And now Finn Balor. Balor's already outsized by Samson, but now Balor's got one good arm. And that's not going to stop him as he goes for the sling blade. And Balor says, your turn! Oh, Driving Samson into the turnbuckle with major force. You see it. And Balor has him where he wants him. Balor with only one good wing, but he only needs his feet. So he has got a moon the coup de grace by Balor. Oh, man. What a win. What a win.